a little bit about your personal story. Oh, my father came to the United States in 1910 oh. and uh, went back to Europe for he joined ended up in the army here and went back to fight in France and was wounded and came back to the states and uh, opened several businesses and then uh, he was in Casper Wyoming and Casper was an oil town but not a very good one so what would happen is the oil wells would sort of run out they'd play out after about 10 years and they'd have to cap them for five years or so to let the pressure build up again. So when that happened, he went back to Greece and got married, swearing to my grandfather he would never take my mother out of Greece. And then, of course, the economy in Greece started going bad in, in, in the late 20s. So he came back to the United States again. And while he was in Greece, just after he got married, my sister and my brother were born. And he came back to Wyoming and my other sister was born. And then the oil ran out again and went back to Greece and that's when I was born. So you were born in Greece actually? Born in Kenya, Greece, yeah. And uh, for how long, I mean until what age you stayed there? 18 months. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I, came, I ended up coming over here in 1935, but that was the fourth trip from so my how, father. How, was, how did you take the decision to become an actor? Because I, I don't know what was your case, but I know many Greeks that at that time they would not consider an actual job being an actor. You, you know, have that problem, I still or say that to this day, I, you know, I, I, I say how is how is work? I it's better than working for a living. Yeah. <laughs> so, no, I. When it was time for me to go to college, they said you have to pick a major, and the only thing I had done so f up until that time was I had done several plays while I was in high school. And I enjoyed it very much. So I figured, all right, I'll major in theater. So that's how I got started. And your family was fine with it? I mean, they didn't have a problem? They weren't thrilled with it, but they didn't give me an argument about it either. Oh, okay. So tell us out of all these, I know you have a long career here. What is, if you could just tell us about one role that you still remember? You know, the most fun I ever had doing a film was uh, there was a series on television called The Virginian and it was a western and they told me don't worry about auditioning because all you do is ride in and out of shots if there's anything complicated they get a stuntman well I got the job and I got the script and the first four pages of the script were a chase me and another guy are chasing this couple on a riding double on a horse and going up and down. I went to a riding stable out here in Chatsworth and I said, I don't care if I know what I'm doing as long as it looks good. Mm -hmm. But I never had so much fun in my life as I did on that shoot. Mm -hmm. Just doing unbelievable riding. And I want to go and if you can talk to us a little bit about your daughter. Uh, she's probably one of our most famous people of Greek descent here, I would say. Did you, did you actually tell her to pick this career here I at all? I never tell anyone to pick this career, including my daughter. Why do you think you should not pick this career? You realize about 5% of actors make a living. And the other 95% have jobs as waiters and whatever and have to do something else. So it's a very difficult profession, and you have to be very fortunate. And, and fortunately for her, she's very talented. Yeah. So, so when, do you, when do you remember maybe that she told you that she wanted to become an actress? She told me when she was in uh, ninth grade. And she came to me one day and said she wanted to go to performing arts high school in New York. And I said, you want to be an actor? She said yes, and it was uh, it was June, I think, or April, and the auditions for the school were in February. I said, I don't know if you're going to be able to get in now because you have to. There's no way you get in that school without auditioning. And uh, we finally managed to arrange an audition for her, 
and she got in. And how about now? Do you like her career? Do you like um, the films that she does? Uh, and, and let's say, what where did you like her? Where did you like her more? At what what film or what uh, oh, like TV show? All. I like them all. Friends, of course, went on for years, and okay. and uh, had she had some wonderful shows on Friends. Mm -hmm. But uh, I like all of her work. How Greek do you think she feels? Do you think she feels Greek? Does she speak any Greek? Kalimera, Kalispera, Kalinikta. So how Greek do you think she, you know? About it. No, I think she, she, she got plenty of Greek inculcated into her from my mother, yeah. from her yaya. And so were they close, the yaya with the... Yeah, they were very close. Okay. And, uh, and the rest of the family, you know, the family is all very Greek. Would you like to see her maybe getting married at some I at some point? You're getting married. Do you point. think it's going to happen soon? I, I hope so. Did, did you meet the... Who was, I think, I don't know, I read that somewhere that she was dating... I think it was John Mayer or somebody. Did you ever get to meet the guy? Or Yes, I met him. Yeah. What, what do you think? Like, as a Greek parent? <laughs> I mean, you know, he was a very charming young man. I, obviously, it, I don't know what... what didn't work out, so who knows?